13 on your side weather deck is sponsored by Montel Construction, your home team. Welcome back to 13 on your side. I'm meteorologist Samantha Jacks outside on the weather deck and the time is now to get out and about and do any outdoor activities that you need to. If you want to get that morning jog in or get the pups out for a walk, this is the perfect time because we have another big push of heat in our forecast, keeping our weather ball solid green. I think we're all ready for the weather ball at this point to turn blue. This is sponsored by Countryside Greenhouse of Allendale. Right now sitting in the 60s across the region underneath mainly clear conditions and we'll see those temperatures continue to climb to 74 degrees by as early as 9 a.m. and then continuing to hit the low to mid 90s. I actually think that today is going to be the warmest day that we've seen all week long. So if you're looking to head to the lake shore, it really is the perfect day to do so. We've got zero foot waves along Lake Michigan and in terms of water temperatures, well, with this unprecedented wave of heat, we've seen our water temperatures, at least on the surface, warm up. They are now sitting in the mid to upper 50s, making it a little bit more bearable if you want to dip your toes in. Yesterday, though, we finally saw some much needed rainfall. Now, not everybody saw as much rain as the other. Our highest was in Pawpaw at 50 or 0.55, so just over a half an inch of rain. South Haven, though, 500ths of an inch here in Grand Rapids at the airport. We registered a hundredth of an inch of rain, so certainly not enough to make up for the deficit that we've been experiencing. And today, I don't think we have the right ingredients there to see any of those pop up showers develop. We're missing one key thing, and that's moisture in the atmosphere. We're going to see dew points dropping down into the low 40s. That really limits the opportunity for us to see a pop up shower. We will see a little bit more moisture resurge into the atmosphere tomorrow, which could bring us an additional chance for an isolated pop up shower in the afternoon and evening. It will be short lived, very similar to what we experienced yesterday. Again, we're talking around 10 to 15 minutes worth of rainfall, a heavy burst of rain at that though, maybe some thunder and lightning, and then you'll be back to dry skies. Temperature wise along the lakeshore today, upper 80s, low 90s. Muskegon, you have broken a record three days in a row now and likely will once again this afternoon as temperatures climb to near 93 degrees. The rest of your 13 on your side 10 day forecast. I do not anticipate nearly as much sunshine throughout the next couple of days. We've got a little bit of haziness, wildfire smoke building into our atmosphere and some more cloud coverage than we've been experiencing.